How's it going everyone? So today I'm going to talk about gynecomastia versus moobs. So I got a question from a subscriber. I have talked about gynecomastia. I will talk about it again to help my subscriber. So what is kind of the difference between man boobs and gynecomastia? What can we do to fix it? How can you really tell the difference in each? So the difference between man boobs and gynecomastia is gynecomastia is actually male breast tissue as opposed to moobs, man boobs, which is just general fat in the male pec area. So that is the big difference. Now, a lot of times people think that they have gynecomastia, but in reality, they just have chest fat. So a good way to actually tell is to feel your pecs. Now, does it feel fatty? Or can you actually feel a gland? If you can feel a gland, then chances are it's gynecomastia. But here's the thing. A lot of you guys don't really know what you're feeling for if you're actually touching correctly. So yes, the best way is to go to the doctor. But I can give you guys an alternative method uh, in order to help you guys out. So if you guys don't have the money, because I know a lot of you guys don't have the money to go to the doctor, you don't have time to see a checkup, or it's just inconvenient, or you just don't want to deal with the doctor, then here's what I recommend to you guys. Start losing weight. And once you start losing the weight, monitor your chest area. So a great example, a great way of doing this is what you want to do is lose weight. You don't have to lose weight for two years. I know some people are going to say unrealistic numbers, two, three years, watch your area. No, lose weight for a month or two. That's it. One or two months. Do a ton of cardio. Here's the thing. If you guys aren't tracking your calories, you don't know how to track your calories, blah, blah, blah. If you want to lose weight, start running. Do a ton of cardio. The weight will literally come off like nothing. The easiest way that I get a ton of people that I train to lose weight is simply just to run. Run, 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 and you will lose a ton of weight. It's really very simple. It raises your metabolism, etc. Now, once you start losing the weight, monitor your chest area. If you notice that your gynecomastia is getting better, then chances are you just have chest fat. If it still looks identical and you've dropped 10, 15 pounds already and it looks identical, chances are you have a little bit of gynecomastia going on. So again, the best way though to tell is simply to go to a doctor, but I know that's not an option. For some people, that's why I'm making this video. So the alternative that I recommend you guys doing is to start losing weight and to monitor that area. I guarantee you for 90% of the people watching this video, you have chest fat. Now some people are gonna be like, no, I don't have chest fat, I have gynecomastia. Be happy, be happy that you have chest fat because that goes away like nothing. If you have gynecomastia, then you're gonna need some more alternatives. So once you lose the weight, then you can start building muscle in that area. So end of video, please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. Please like the video and share it. Thanks for watching.